Hey guys, it's Evangelina and today we're in Feather Family. So today we're doing the Griffin vs Cockatrice, which has been highly requested. Okay, so both of these birds have special features. So the Griffin, we have land rest emotes, youngling stage, walks on clouds and spawns in skylands. For the Cockatrice, we have web dragon wings and the egg is slightly longer and larger. Okay, so there's three stages for both of these. Griffin hatchling, Griffin young and Griffin adult. Then we have Cockatrice Egg, Cockatrice Hatchling, and Cockatrice Adult. The Griffin costs 600 Robux, while the Cockatrice costs 500 Robux. Comment below which one you think is better so far. Okay, so let's go ahead and pick the baby stage for both of these. So we have the Griffin Youngling and the Cockatrice Egg. Okay, so here's where they spawn. You can see the two different spawn locations. Okay, so this is where both of these spawn. So we have the roll for the cockatrice. And for the griffin, we have the walk. Okay, so we have run for griffin and shake for cockatrice. For the next demo, they have call cool. griffin. Well, shake for the cockatrice. Now we have sit for griffin. Eat the griffin. And hurt the griffin. Lay for griffin. Eyes open and close for the griffin. Okay, okay. Now the griffin as a baby can't fly. But this is something that they both can't do. Now we have the griffin and the cockatrice. So here's both their runs. Two different runs. Okay, I think I like the griffins a little more. But the cockatrice is a different one. Cockatrice call, griffin call. There's the cockatrice's call. Now both of their sits. Okay. Here we have the two sit emotes and we have the eat emotes. I think I like the cockatrice for this one more. Now I have the hurt emote. Hurt for both of them. Griffin looks a bit better from, in my opinion. I think the Griffin looks a bit better. Now we're gonna try lay emote. Here's the lay and the rest for the Griffin. Rest, okay. Now we're gonna try eyes, open and close for both of them. And fly. Okay, so the griffin can fly, but not for a long time. As you can see, this bird must rest. See, so it just has a little bit of a fly. Let's keep our current colors for both of them and hatch them. And for grow them up. Okay, so we have the griffin adult and cockatrice adult. Okay, so here's both their runs. As you can see, the griffin is a little bit bigger. So here's Griffin Run and Cockatrice Run. Now let's try the Griffin's Call. And the Cockatrice's Call. Let's try Griffin Sit. And now the Cockatrice's Sit. Okay, so here's both their sits and their eats. So this is the griffin's eating emotion and the cockatrice's eating emotion. I'm going to have to go ahead and say I like the griffin's one. Okay, so hurt. Here's both of their hurt side by side. I think, um, I don't really know if I have to say it as a winner in hurt. And display. Okay, so they both have two very different displays, but I do like them both equally. Okay, so there's the displays. Now we have the griffin's preen. And the cockatrice's preen, pretty much the same. Pretty good. Okay. Now let's both try their eyes. So eyes open, close, the same. Now we're going to try lay for griffin. And the magic eyes for the cockatrice. 
Sadly, the griffin does not have any powers. So here's both their flies. I do like the cockatrice because it has a cool little trail, which the griffin does not have. So I'm going to give the cockatrice a win on the fly. There's both of them. Yeah, so I think cockatrice wins, but comment down below which fly you want. Now let's let them both build a nest. Cockatrice's nest and griffin's nest. I think the cockatrice's nest is a little bit bigger, but I'm not sure. Okay, so there's their nests. Okay, now let's go teleport somewhere else. Oh, okay, here we are with the griffin and the cockatrice. Now we're going to fly around. I really like the trail. Comment down below which fly you like, but honestly, if I were to say, I think I would like the cockatrice because it has more of an effect when it's flying, and I think that is pretty cool. Although the griffin does have better wing movements, and I think it does look cool, but I'm going to have to say, for me, I like the cockatrice, but what do you like? Okay, let's go ahead and land in this magical tower. Oh, it's just turned day. Oh, there's an egg. Rah! Okay, let's see if we can scare that egg away. Oh, now we're gonna fly as a griffin. And cockatrice scaring everybody. I do like the cockatrice's eyes. I think that flamey eye sort of thing is pretty cool. Let's fly around a little bit. Oh, look on the griffin side. We can see all of the sky islands. Now, I know many of you said, can the griffin sit on clouds and walk on clouds? Let me just show you in a minute. Oh, okay, now the griffin's underneath in the secret cave area. Oh, there's a big ostrich. Let's walk around. Oh my gosh, we see the king griffin on the cockatrice's side. Let's bow down to the king. Walk around. Oh, okay, Griffin. Let's go up here. Now, can the Griffin walk on clouds? Let me just let me just say. Yes, the Griffin can. He can walk on clouds, guys. Now let's fly around the cockatrice and see if the cockatrice can. Okay, will it work? Let's see. No, so the cockatrice cannot walk on the cloud. So that's a super cool feature, which I think the griffin does have on its side. Okay, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this cockatrice versus griffin comparison video. Like and subscribe if you want more videos like this. Until I see you gamers next time, goodbye.